everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. In this video, we are going to be diving back into a topic we did over a year ago. And honestly, I was looking through some of my videos and I saw this one, I was like, that was so much fun. Why did I stop doing that? And then I was like, let's try it again. Let's see if the people are still interested in shopping with the inverted filter or the grayscale filter on and seeing what we get when we put outfits together. I had so much fun filming these and it seemed like you guys were really enjoying it. So I thought, let's keep it going. So basically, this is exactly how it sounds. We're gonna put the grayscale filter on and we're also gonna do the inverted filter. We'll do one outfit grayscale, one outfit inverted. And then when it comes here, we're gonna be shocked by the look. Sometimes we'll get like yellow pants with like a blue shirt which that was supposed to sound like it doesn't go together well, but that would actually be probably cute. I'm not sure. But yeah, so the color combinations are completely out of our hands. If you don't understand just yet, just watch and you will understand. I am making an attempt to do quicker intros. So let's just get in to the video. <laughs> let's start with the invert. Boing. Wow. So you can imagine how that's gonna mess up our shopping. Oh, you know what else this would be fun with if we did this, but for makeup? Yes, that would be fun. If you guys would like to see that in the future, let me know. But all right, let's go. ASOS has so much clothing. So let's just go into tops and put something together. I mean, I'm not really looking for anything in particular, which makes it pretty easy. That could be fun though. Like those are what I'm looking for. Things that are going to like shock us, be very bright and fun. Okay, this might be fun. It's mesh. I mean, it looks nice. I'm not going to look at any of the colors. And now we gotta get a tank top for underneath that. Maybe this one would look good underneath. It's like a cropped thingamajiggy. Really shopping like this, it's kind of like, what are we really choosing from, you know? Like that looks nice, I guess. Let's go with it. Let's go for shorts because it's getting nice out. Shorts or skirt maybe. Ooh, a skirt. A skirt could be cute actually. I feel like the more and more I say skirt, the more it doesn't sound like a real word. Now I'm struggling. I'm officially struggling now. This is kind of nice. Actually, maybe I just want a normal skirt. Okay, let's see, let's see. I'm just looking at style. I actually just noticed that it says the color. Like here it says River Island Petite Rouge Side Skirt in black. So don't look at that, okay? I won't look at it if you don't look at it. Promise me and I will promise you, okay? I promise. I don't know, how would that look? I kind of like this one, but would it go with the other things I've chosen? I kind of think it could be nice. Let's try it. Okay, so this is the outfit we have. Honestly, inverted, it doesn't look fantastic together, but maybe not inverted will look better. That's our first outfit. Actually, should we add shoes to it maybe? Or like a bag? Let's add an accessory. I like the idea of a toad bag. Okay, this is cute. I like the Care Bears on there. Let's go with this one. This looks scary. I feel like this is gonna be like super bright in real life, we'll see. But okay, that will be our inverted look. Actually, you know what? It looks a little bad. The Care Bear bag helped. Okay, let's go with that. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and turn on the grayscale and pick another outfit. This one I always feel like is a little bit harder for me because everything starts to look the same. I'm gonna go for a sweater, maybe sweater with shorts. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Oh, that's so cute. I like that. I wonder if I should get that just in general. Maybe we'll do two grayscale outfits simply just because I want this. I truly never know what shoes to wear with any outfits ever, if I'm being honest. Like shoes are nearly impossible for me to figure out. I mean like this is cute. These look nice. Like would this be a nice outfit? I honestly don't. I feel like I know what wicker is gonna look like. Okay, that got off topic of that look. Okay, chunky sweater. Okay, okay, these are cute. Oh my gosh, that one is so cute. What the heck, that is so cute. <gasps> I'm struggling to figure this out, to be honest. These look cute. I like the boxy looking shorts. They look like they're like a linen. I like that. Oh my gosh, that's pretty cute actually. Are those legit holes in them though? Because if so, I don't want holes in my shorts. <sighs> they are all gray. That's the problem with gray scale. Everything is gray. Oh my gosh, I'm so low too. I'm like, this is how I shop. 
I think this is a struggle for me because it's already hard enough for me to put an outfit together when I have all the factors. And now to have none of the factors and be putting it together, I'm like, how am I supposed to do this? I don't want this to be ruined because I don't know how to put outfits together. Okay, I needed to take a moment and find a completely new outfit. So I found this shirt, which I feel like patterns like this are fun in these videos because we don't know what they're gonna look like, but we know it's gonna be loud. And then these pants, I mean, it looks like it's gonna be like neutral, maybe like a beige. So I think that'll be safe. And then this hat, again, I would guess it's like an oatmeal color. So that's one outfit. And then of course we have this outfit that I put together just because I saw that dress. So. That is everything. We have three outfits coming, two of which were picked with grayscale and one with the inverted filter. I guess I'll just talk to you when they get here and we can take a look. Probably will be a couple weeks for me and a millisecond for you, so let's do it. Let's get out of this weird outfit and into another weird one, shall we? Honestly though, if you ignore the sweatpants, this top is so cute. I got it thrifting a few weeks ago. Love. Eyelid fabric. Anyways, I'm gonna try not to get off topic. The package has arrived. And again, I am hit with the reality that ASOS always has a ton of customs because I think it's a UK brand. So it makes sense. It's going over the seas. Let's dive in. I hardly remember the outfits I put together. And of course it was black and white or inverted. So this first look should be a shock. Whoa. We got all different colors up in here. Whoa, oh my gosh. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Everything is so colorful. Like everything is colorful. Oh my gosh. Just based on this first glance, I don't know if it'll go together, but let us see. I cannot for the life of me remember the outfits I had put together. I can't remember. And now seeing all the colors, I like don't remember even more because nothing goes together. I may need to grab my laptop and check what I had put together. Hold on a minute. I'm excited because I see lots of green things. Okay. So it was the Care Bears tank or the Care Bears top with this skirt with this tank top. Okay, okay. Oh, that doesn't look bad. Oh wait, and this went on there? Oh, me trying to figure out these outfits right now is hilarious. Okay, wait. Let us start with the outfit that we bought while well, it was inverted. It was looking pretty solid until we got to this top. First of all, this skirt is adorable. I couldn't have picked a better color if I tried. It's a beautiful sage green and it goes awesome with this Care Bears bag, which by the way, inverted, this looked borderline scary and now it looks really cute. Another green top, this time way more electric. I like the lace detail. Although I don't, I don't think I normally would have paired these two greens together. But I mean, we'll see. And then for over top, this mesh top, which absolutely in no way makes sense together. I think this is gonna be a hot mess. Let's put it on. Okay. Okay, wait a minute. Okay, wait a second. This is not the worst outfit I've ever seen in my entire life. No, it is not. Firstly, can we talk about this skirt? Because I am obsessed with this skirt. It couldn't fit better if it was made exactly to my measurements. Like this, this skirt, this skirt was worth this entire video, in my humble opinion. Except it should have pockets. Oh, it does! Oh, it does! Okay, okay, I'm obsessed. No, no, I'm obsessed. Let me just drop this bag for a second because I think it's throwing it off. Initially, this electric green was way too much, but then I put this mesh top on and it almost made it look purposeful and nice. Not to mention it's a turtleneck, so that's a check mark. I'm shocked and surprised. I thought the mesh shirt was gonna ruin it, but it doesn't. The standout now is the bag, which I threw to the side, but I need to have it here because it's something we chose. This is sticking out a lot, but I'm a little bit shocked. It looks good on. I'm, I'm not hating it. And I also really like how comfortable it is. Like I know that's not what this is about, 
but I love a long skirt. I love a turtleneck. I mean, I guess I picked the fit. Why am I shocked by the fit? I picked it. I am only shocked by the colors. <sighs> Sorry, my judging system is confused. Basically, I'm liking it. I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10. I just wish the bag matched a little bit better. Like if this was a cow print or something fun, it'd be better. I'm really excited about this top because crazy patterns when they're black and white, you really don't know what you're gonna get. And this is what we got. We've got orange, we've got red, we've got cheetah prints. We have a lot of different animal prints actually going on in here. And then this beautiful like paisley print. This is really nice, but I'm a little bit scared because of the color of the pants. I thought these were gonna be beige. And actually if they were beige, it would have looked really good together. But they are in fact bubblegum pink, which is beautiful and iconic. And honestly, I'll get a lot of wear out of these. But in this outfit, no. And then what does this crazy explosion need? A green straw hat. But let's put it on. Maybe it'll look good on. The hotness is here. Minus the hot. Okay, well, it definitely looks like I bought this with the grayscale filter on. I'm not tricking anyone. I mean, each individual piece is giving to be honest. I hope I have the wherewithal to figure out how to style these pieces because of the top, I'm loving this top. I love the sleeves. Look at these sleeves, so fun. The pants are everything. They're really, really long, so I, I think you're supposed to wear heels with them or just be longer legged than me, I'm not sure. Um, so I'll work on that. <laughs> I also just really love the fabric of these pants and the fact that they're pink. I mean, underwear line realness. This hat, also loving the hat, but all together, it's a no. I think we can all agree that this looks weird, but also like if I saw someone else wearing it, I might just believe that it was fashionable. So I don't know what to say about that because if someone else was wearing it, honestly, I would probably be like, okay, work, stylish diva. But with me, I'm like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> I think the issue is every piece is a show-stopping piece. Like we have a silk pant and this crazy, beautiful, weird pattern, blah, blah, blah. It gets a seven, a seven, it's fair. <laughs> Okay, the last outfit was kind of just an extra thing because I saw this dress, which by the way, I am overjoyed to see that this is pink. I love, love, love pink. It's also very soft and comfortable feeling, like a very good summer dress. Not super shocked with this one that the wicker bag is a wicker color, but you never know. It could have been something crazy, but it's not. As for shoes though, I thought for sure these were going to be just black and white, but there is a color pop of yellowy orange on here. I don't think this will clash. This actually might be the best outfit. Let's put it on and let's see. Wouldn't it be just our luck for the extra outfit to be the best one? I think it would be. Either way though, these shoes are cute. I'm so happy with that this dress is in my possession. I knew when I saw it and it has lived up every day since, except for the fact that it's a little see-through on the back, but we will work with that. You know what? Everything you love needs work. If I'm looking a little taller than normal, it's because I have these shoes on, which this whole outfit looks really nice. Definitely nicer than I would normally look on your average Tuesday. Uh, let me just try and stand up here, which is probably a little bit dangerous. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, look at those shoes. Aren't they fun? They're so chunky. Here's my outfit. I mean, come on. You, what is my foot doing right now? Why do my legs look like this right now? You know what? I'm gonna get down. I'm gonna get down. There. That's a better way to show the shoes as well. Just standing like a flamingo. Oh my gosh, and I'm pink like a flamingo. This is the look. Very cute outfit here. I think this is perfect for date night. It's a little more dressy than I would normally do, but I must say this dress looks super cute and it's so comfortable. And thank goodness it's pink because I feel like if it was like a beige or a white or a black, 
it wouldn't be as fun. Like the pink makes it a statement and it makes it fun. So I'm on board with the pink. The extra outfit takes the cake, I think. I think it's the winner. What do you think? All right, do we love it? Do we hate it? Are we obsessed with it? Are we mad at it? What do you think? I obviously, as you can probably tell by my smiling face, I am super happy with each piece. Yes, the outfits weren't always 100%, but the pieces, like I feel like I just got a bunch of new pieces that are really, really cute and will hopefully go together well with things already in my closet. Like I'm making some mediocre outfits in my head and it's like really working, yes. Like I'm counting down the days till I can wear those pink satin pants. Like where? I don't know, but it needs to happen. Okay, let's look back on the outfits. The inverted outfit was a wild and crazy success minus the bag. I'm actually very impressed with that look. The grayscale outfit, the pieces were great. Together, a little bit weird, but uh, I don't even know. Like with the right confidence, you could sell that. The extra outfit, I mean, it, there wasn't much going on with it, but I was just thrilled that the dress was pink because I love pink. And I also just, it's so comfortable. I really like this dress. Sometimes I honestly think I pick better pieces if it's inverted or grayscale, just because left to my own resources, I put the weirdest things together. So maybe I should just always shop like this because it was pretty successful. I mean, the outfits don't look amazing together, but the pieces are cute. And I don't think I would have normally bought that top that was in the second outfit, but it might be one of my favorite pieces. But yeah, I'm interested to see if if you guys like this video again, I know this was a concept I did like a year ago and I sort of just stopped doing it all completely. So if you guys would like to see more, make sure to let me know down below. Also, I recently started doing shorts on my channel, so I'm very interested to hear if you guys enjoyed them or not. So if you haven't watched them yet, if you would go watch them and then let me know in the comments if you like them or if you wanna see anything in the shorts. I'm trying to really produce them well and not just use recycled content. So yeah, let me know. As always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!